Today we are making bamboo because our panda bear is very hungry. So hit the letter P on the keyboard or the pen tool on the left side. And basically we're going to draw one of the uh, s sections of the bamboo. Um, remember when you draw, you have to hold it down and then you can draw something like that. Okay. Now you'll want to have a um, no stroke. And then for the the fill, the fill can be like a green because bamboo is usually some sort of green color. Now you see this extra line right here? I want to get rid of that. So remember you hit option click and then I can get rid of it. And then I'm going to click right there like that. And then my bamboo is going to go down like that. So basically we're making the little edges or knobs of our bamboo. Um, if you look at the answer key when we're done, um, it looks kind of like this. So see how the bamboo shoots have a knob at the end? So let's go ahead and do that. Make sure you close it at the end just because it looks colored. That doesn't mean that it's done. So make sure that's closed. And if you want to edit it, hit A for the direct selection tool and then you can move it around to get exactly the way you want it. Okay. Now our bamboo is basically just one color which is kind of boring so we want to use the mesh tool to make it more of a gradient but not like if you just use a regular gradient let's see if we just use a regular gradient on our bamboo, it's going to look, you know, it looks kind of goofy. So that's why the mesh tool right here, or the letter U on your keyboard, is very uh, useful. Okay, so hit the mesh tool. And basically, click on the bottom left anchor, or the bottom left part of your uh, bamboo to create where it should be. Okay. Now with the gradient tool still selected, what you're going to do is go to your color guide and uh, choose a green and then you'll have a lot of different colors of green or shades. Basically we want to work with a lot of shades of green and then we can choose like a yellow, um, like click on the right side of it and then it automatically gives it that color that you have selected. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and add some yellow to this. And I'm also going to add some darker green to the other side. So all I'm doing is with the mesh tool, I have I choose my color and then I just click on the lines and it will automatically mesh a color into that. And then when I'm done it kind of looks like that. Now if, it, if there's parts that look kind of silly you can like take those out. So that looks a little bit better. Okay now we're gonna make three strands of bamboo. So that's one and now we're going to make three. So there's one, we're going to duplicate it and make a second, make sure they're connected and then duplicate and a third. And so make sure that they're all uh, lined up with each other. Something like that. Okay. And then you're going to highlight them and you're going to group them, Command G. 
so that they're one. And you can choose the thickness of them. Now, does bamboo ever grow like straight? No, it's kind of like twisty. Okay, so what we're going to do is, let's see. Um, what you're going to do is take your bamboo and you're going to go to filter, distort, and twist. And I'm going to twist about two degrees. And you'll notice that it twisted it with it. Okay, so notice it's a little bit more realistic now. Now I'm going to take that same bamboo and I'm going to reflect it. Okay, I don't want to just make a copy because it looks kind of obvious. It's like right next to each other. So I'm going to hit the ref double click on the reflect tool or the letter. And then I'm going to hit uh, copy and notice it reflects a copy of it so it doesn't look exactly alike. Okay. So I'm going to make about one, two, three, four, five, six. Six different uh, ones. And you can choose the size that you want. For example, maybe this middle one will make it a little thicker. Maybe this one will make it a little thinner. And maybe this one I'll rotate it a little bit. And maybe. Maybe this one I'll twist it a little bit more. So filter, twist. And this one will rotate a, a lot. So I have one, two, and I'm going to set them some out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I have my six bamboos. Now what I'm going to do is we need some leaves. Okay, so with the pen tool, okay, you're going to be drawing some simple uh, leaves. And you're going to fill those green as well. So I'm just using my pen tool. Okay. And you'll notice that it's kind of sharp bamboo, like sharp and thin. So I'm going to try to keep that consistent. Now I'm going to select my mesh tool, U on the keyboard, and I'm going to select a different color. And then I'm going to click on one of the edges, and it's going to automatically help me make it a mesh. So now I'm ready to create a symbol. It's a lot easier to create using a symbol 